I've been part of Downstate since 1994, and I've actually been uh, acting chair or chair of the program since 1999. When I started here, we were offering a bachelor's degree in physical therapy, a BS degree. Then a couple of years later, we moved on to a master's in physical therapy. By 2009, we graduated our first class of uh, doctor of physical therapy students. And that has been a very exciting thing for me to see this great change that's taking place in my profession. I've always been on the path to go into health, like health sciences and all that. I was initially planning on med school, but then I realized that physical therapy was more on the lines of what I wanted to do with my life. My classmates, honestly, uh, they make the entire scenario like worth it. They make the whole situation really worth it. Like sometimes you might not have a good day, but they're here and they make it better. 66% of the class is black, Latino, and Asian. The remaining 33% is white. So you can see that there's, there's no majority in the class. There's just, it's just a wonderful tapestry of all different uh, races and religions and uh, nationalities that students learn a lot from each other. I applied here because it was mainly the affordability, the diversity that I was looking for along with that. I realized that you also didn't need a bachelor's. I had one, but the benefit of that is that the first year that we have is uh, more affordable than other doctor of physical therapy programs elsewhere. If you look at our national American Physical Therapy Association meetings, we don't look as diverse as we ought to. But here at Downstate, you know, we're doing much better. We're a very young profession by the standards of looking at how old medicine and nursing are. We've come so far in these hundred years from first being rehab aides that worked with soldiers in World War I all the way through to today. So many of them are going into outpatient orthopedic practices because that's where a lot of PT is taking place today. It's much more cost effective and it gets the patient out of the hospital sooner, you know, less chance for nosocomial infections and, you know, they they able to rehab much more quickly. PT has just come such a long way in these in just in the past 26 years that I've witnessed since I've been here at SUNY Downstate.